10 NBA players to move teams the most. Not all NBA players would be lucky to spend their entire career in one team like Kobe and Tim Duncan. For some, it would take years and years of trading before settling down a team that carries them through their greatest potential. In this video, let's take a look at the 10 NBA players who have played for more teams than you could ever imagine. At number 10, we have Harrison Barnes. Upon entering the 2012 draft, Barnes' skills were rewarded as he was among the early picks in the draft. He was selected by the Golden State Warriors in the first round as the seventh pick. Into the 2016-17 seasons, Barnes penned a $94 million four-year deal with the Dallas Mavericks. He surpassed the team records again as regards points in the next season to establish a quiet but deadly attack for the team and recorded a double-double eight times through the season. In 2019, Barnes completed a swap move to his current team, the Sacramento Kings. At number 9, we have Nate Robinson. Robinson played college basketball for the University of Washington in Seattle and was selected with the 21st overall pick by the Phoenix Suns in the 2005 NBA Draft. He was later traded to the New York Knicks on draft. The 5'9'' point guard has also played for the Boston Celtics, the Oklahoma City Thunder, the Golden State Warriors, Chicago Bulls, and Denver Nuggets. Robinson is the NBA's first three-time slam dunk champion. At number 8, we have Shaquille O'Neal. O'Neal was drafted by the Orlando Magic with the first overall pick in the 1992 NBA Draft. He quickly became one of the best centers in the league, winning Rookie of the Year in 1992-93 and leading his team to the 1995 NBA Finals. After four years with the Magic, O'Neal signed as a free agent with the Los Angeles Lakers. They won three consecutive championships in 2000 until 2002. Amid tension between O'Neal and Kobe Bryant, O'Neal was traded to the Miami Heat in 2004 and his fourth NBA championship followed in 2006. Midway through the 2007-2008 seasons, he was traded to the Phoenix Suns. After a season and a half with the Suns, O'Neal was traded to the Cleveland Cavaliers in the 2009-2010 seasons. O'Neal played for the Boston Celtics in the 2010-2011 season before retiring. At number 7, we have Tracy McGrady. McGrady entered the NBA straight out of high school and was selected as the ninth overall pick by the Toronto Raptors in the 1997 NBA Draft. Beginning his career as a low-minute player, he gradually improved his role with the team, eventually forming an exciting duo with his cousin, Vince Carter. In 2000, he left the Raptors for the Orlando Magic, where he became one of the league's most prolific scorers and a candidate for the NBA Most Valuable Player Award. In 2004, he was traded to the Houston Rockets, where he paired with center Yao Ming to help the Rockets become a perennial playoff team. His final seasons in the NBA were plagued by injuries, and he retired in 2013 following a brief stint with the Quindao Double Star Eagles of the Chinese Basketball Association and the San Antonio Spurs. Moving on at number 6 is Dwight Howard. Howard, who plays center, spent his high school career at Southwest Atlanta Christian Academy. He chose to forego college entering the 2004 NBA Draft and was selected first overall by the Orlando Magic. Howard set numerous franchise and league records during his time with the Magic. In 2009, he led the team to the NBA Finals. Howard was named to the All-NBA Third Team after having received five consecutive first-team honors. In 2012, after eight seasons with Orlando, Howard was traded to the Lakers. Following a one-year stint with the Lakers, he played for the Houston Rockets, the Atlanta Hawks, the Charlotte Hornets, and the Washington Wizards. At number 5, we have Vince Carter. Carter was selected with the 5th overall pick in the 1998 NBA Draft by the Golden State Warriors who traded him to the Toronto Raptors. Carter emerged as a star in Toronto as he won the 1999 NBA Rookie of the Year award and the slam dunk contest at the 2000 NBA All-Star Weekend. In December 2004, Carter was traded to the New Jersey Nets where he continued his offensive success. Carter also played for the Orlando Magic, Phoenix Suns, Dallas Mavericks, Memphis Grizzlies, Sacramento Kings, and Atlanta Hawks. He received the Twimmin Stokes Teammate of the Year Award in 2016. At number 4, we have Rajon Pierce Rondo. Rondo was drafted 21st overall by the Phoenix Suns in the 2006 NBA Draft. 
He was subsequently traded to the Celtics, where he played a supporting role during his rookie season. He was named to the All-NBA third team in 2011-2012 and has earned four NBA All-Defensive Team honors. During his time in Boston, Rondo helped the Celtics advance to the NBA Finals in 2008 and 2010, winning a championship in 2008 as the team's starting point guard. Rondo has long been known as an elite facilitator in the NBA, ranking fourth in Celtics history in assists and third in steals. After eight seasons with the Celtics, Rondo was traded to the Dallas Mavericks in December 2014. A tumultuous five-month stint ensued, and in 2015, Rondo joined the Sacramento Kings. In 2016, he joined the Chicago Bulls before joining the New Orleans Pelicans in 2017 and the Lakers in 2018. Coming in at third, we have Chucky Brown. A 6'7 forward from North Carolina State, Brown was selected by the Cleveland Cavaliers in the second round of the 1989 NBA Draft. Brown shares the NBA record for the most teams played for during his NBA career. The Cavaliers, Los Angeles Lakers, New Jersey Nets, Dallas Mavericks, Houston Rockets, where he became a champion in 1994-95, the Phoenix Suns, the Milwaukee Bucks, Atlanta Hawks, Charlotte Hornets, San Antonio Spurs, Golden State Warriors, and Sacramento Kings. In addition to the NBA teams, Brown had stints in the Continental Basketball Association and Italy's Panna Firenze. He became the second player to earn both an NBA ring and CBA ring in the same season. At number two, we have Matt Barnes. Barnes was selected with the 46th overall pick by the Memphis Grizzlies in the 2002 NBA Draft and was immediately traded to the Cleveland Cavaliers. The Cavaliers assigned him for the NBA D-League and he joined the Fayetteville Patriots for the 2002-2003 seasons. In October 2004, he signed with the Sacramento Kings and was traded halfway through the season to the Philadelphia 76ers. Barnes signed a free agent contract with the New York Knicks in October 2005. He was waived by the Knicks after playing just six games. He was then claimed by the 76ers to serve a second stint in Philadelphia, where he finished out the season. Barnes signed with the Golden State Warriors before their first day of training camp in October 2006. The following years, Barnes signed a one-year contract with the Phoenix Suns, a two-year contract with the Orlando Magic, and he also played with the Los Angeles Lakers and Los Angeles Clippers. He returned to the Golden State Warriors in 2017, where he won his first NBA championship. And the number one on our list is Ish Smith. After going undrafted on the 2010 NBA Draft, Smith signed with the Houston Rockets on August 23, 2010. On January 17, 2011, he was assigned to the Rio Grande Valley Vipers of the NBA Development League. He was recalled by the Rockets on January 24. On 2011, Smith was traded to the Memphis Grizzlies and he was claimed off waivers by the Golden State Warriors. The following year, he signed with the Orlando Magic, then was traded to the Milwaukee Bucks in February 2013. On August 2013, he was traded to the Phoenix Suns. The following year of July, he signed with the Houston Rockets and on November, he signed with the Oklahoma City Thunder. He also played for the New York Pelicans, Philadelphia 76ers, Washington Wizards, and Detroit Pistons. On July 2019, Smith signed with the Washington Wizards. This marked Smith's 11th team he played for in the last eight seasons. Make sure to keep posted with our videos to keep yourselves updated with your favorite star's whereabouts. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe for more.